He was full of the most love. He had a pastor's heart, whether you were in his church or not. It has been almost one week since a pastor from Dandridge died on a snorkeling trip in Florida. Witnesses say he called out for help in the water and then stopped breathing. He, it is still unclear just how he died. Tennis reporter Katie Inman spoke with a family of that pastor about his deep faith. His legacy is loving his Jesus. The sign out front Reed Town Community Church and the silent sanctuary hold the memory of Pastor Rob Chambers. Daddy, that's what he is. I mean, he's full time dad, full time employee, but but this, the church is what he cared about the most. Olivia, Abigail and Tyler on the phone remember their dad as a man with unshakable faith. He was all about the Lord and he cared about everyone deep down. You could always count on him, a constant presence. And he was that for everybody, not even just his kids, his church family too. He died on vacation last Friday while snorkeling off the coast of Key Largo. It doesn't matter why, like I know it's all for a reason, it's all for the glory of God. And I know where he is. He's at Jesus' feet, and that's all he ever wanted. The community offered up prayers, donations, and support. And we're just so blessed. While he won't preach from this pulpit again, Rob's family has no question heaven welcomed him with open arms. But I know the second I get to heaven and he comes up and turns around, he's going to say, hey, baby, just the same. And I'm just going to mess up. Until then, they'll find peace in these pews. I think the message he would want to give people is you never know when, so you need to get right with God. You need to have your life in order. Yes, you need to cherish your family, but you never know when God's going to say it's time. In Newport, I'm Katie Inman. Specifics on the funeral for that pastor haven't been announced, but right now on our website, you will find links to help his family.